Money is important. Dollar bills are money in paper form. There are different bills with different values. In the United States, we use one, five, ten, twenty, fifty, and one hundred dollar bills most often. Each bill is labeled with its value. Money can also come in coin form. In the U.S., we use pennies, nickels, dimes, and quarters most often. Each type of coin looks different. Pennies are the only copper-colored coin. They are each worth one cent. The other coins are silver-colored. Nickels are worth five cents. Dimes are worth ten cents. They are the smallest of the coins. Quarters are worth twenty-five cents and are the biggest of the coins. When counting money, we can add up the value of each coin. Colleen received change after buying milk at the store. Let's look in Colleen's wallet and count her change. Let's start with the paper bills. Colleen has two one-dollar bills. That's two dollars. Now let's count the coins. Start with the coins with the highest value. She has one quarter, which is worth twenty-five cents, and a dime, which is worth ten cents. She also has three nickels, which are each worth five cents. To find the total value of the nickels, we can skip count by fives: five, ten, fifteen. Colleen has fifteen cents worth of nickels. She also has one penny, which is worth one cent. When we add up the values of the bills and coins, we see that Colleen received two dollars and fifty-one cents back as change. This isn't the only way the cashier could have given Colleen her change. We can make different combinations of bills and coins to represent the same amount of money.